In a time where we usually hear about health care cuts, one service may actually be coming back to Arizona's health care system, podiatry. What we're asking for is for the patient to get the best care possible. Podiatrists are foot care specialists, and they're asking state lawmakers to restore regular podiatric care to access. And those are for Mr. Esposito. We first spotlighted this problem last September when we visited with Dr. Patrick Cotlin in Cochise County. At that time, he described how difficult it is to care for his patients with foot problems, like diabetics with poor blood circulation, since access cuts meant he could no longer refer his patients to a podiatrist. You know, I examine feet and there's certain things I can do for them, but it's, I don't think, the same as being able to see a podiatrist on a routine basis. House Bill 2236 would restore podiatry as a covered service in access, allowing patients to receive foot care on a regular basis. Representative Matt Hines, a physician himself, says it's crucial for diabetics with foot complications to receive this constant care. A regular visit every month or every couple of weeks to a podiatrist who is an expert on making sure those things do not get out of control would cost very little relative to the expense of an admission to the hospital. A representative from Access says they took those things into consideration, but cuts had to be made somewhere. We did, in calculating those savings, recognize that there would be circumstances in which individuals would go to see another specialist, such as an orthopedic surgeon. But this day, lawmakers decided to pass the bill, meaning doctors like Patrick can catch the problem early, before it ends up out of control. In Phoenix, Andy Ellison, Cronkite News.